Are you going to have an EMG and you find yourself a little nervous because you do not know what to expect? Well, an EMG is a nerve and muscle examination. Now, the nerve examination is done by using electrical impulses on the extremities, meaning arms and legs. So the technologist, when he starts, he should start with the intensity at zero. Increase it until you feel it. And all he's going to do past that is use the exact amount of intensity that your body structure needs, that your nerve needs in order for the nerves to depolarize or react. Now, he's going to do the nerve study on the arms. All the nerves that you have on the arms are connected to the neck and all the nerves you have on the legs are connected to the lower back. So he gets a lot of information when it comes to your body. Now, the muscle examination is done by using a needle electro. Now, the, the physiatrist or the neurologist, which are the two main doctors when it comes to electrodiagnostic medicine, when it comes to EMGs, do not use electrical impulses. They use a needle electro. They pinch the muscle and record the electrical activity of that muscle. Now, is it painful? Well, it's not the most comfortable thing in the world, but it feels like acupuncture. If you had acupuncture, that's basically the way it feels like. But if you can pinch yourself a little bit, then that's basically what it's going to feel like. And obviously, if, if it's done properly, if you go to the right place, then you're going to have a pleasant experience. And you can tell by the level of communication, the way they, they communicate this, these studies to you. Now, if you want a little bit of more information uh, when it comes to uh, EMGs, you, there's a link on my homepage and on my TikTok homepage, and I my YouTube link there, and I have tons of videos when it comes to EMGs, when it comes to uh, nerve examinations. Uh, just one thing that I forgot to mention, when the neurologist or physiatrist does the EMG, that's going to be done either on the neck, well, depending on your clinical diagnosis, that's going to be done on the neck, on the shoulders, the arm muscles, lower back, maybe some muscles of the thigh, and some muscles on the legs. I'll see you in the next video, and if you have an opportunity, please, now you can visit my YouTube channel.